Hello, my name is Bart Brecka, and today I want to present a video that adds ribs in a unique way to a soap dish that I created in an earlier video. Before I start, however, I just wanted to share with you uh, a resume posting section that we've created for non-degreed engineers and uh, engineers alike. I can just scroll down and, and click on mine at jobs.designengine.com and uh, you can see I can create a picture resume plus my actual written resume and uh, there's probably about 100 persons that have added added to their added to the resume section of the jobs.designengine job board okay now I'm gonna go into I've already got Creo up and what I want to do is just add add a datum plane and then add my rib in a different kind of way. So I'm going to right click on top of this datum plane. I'm going to right click through here to query through to the actual datum plane. And I'm going to offset a datum plane with respect to the first datum plane. I'm going to use that datum plane. Do you see how it's still selected? I'm going to use that datum plane to create a sketch. And what, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to sketch my rib across there and then check out of it and hit extrude. And instead of being very careful to lock my rib to the outer, outer edges of the product, I'm just going to overextend that geometry and right click on this dot, right, this black dot, this white dot. Now that I clicked on it, it's black and hit through next. Okay, what I did is I created a rib. Now in plastic park design, you know, we've all, professionals have all made mistakes. That's ultimately how one learns. If you get a sink mark in a product, it's probably because you didn't follow the 70% rule. And this rib needs to be 70% of this material thickness, 0.08. So in a later video, I'll share how to, I'll, I'll go ahead and pattern it now, but in a later video, I'll, I'll share how one can tie that that width to a parameter in the actual uh, part into the actual shell thickness variable as a variable. Thank you for listening to my video and uh, please consider coming to Design Engine in the near future.